The next upload for this morning is with regard to the credibility and integrity and the common sense um, that would be required in circumstances when human rights abuses are being abused or violated. Um, the issue of professionalism of individuals that have been developing artificial intelligence in Tralee County Kerry since damaging my sacred light um, is an issue that I'm bringing to the fore for agencies of artificial intelligence that respect the um, principles and the foundations of good practice in the field of artificial intelligence. Now, as I've mentioned, um, this entire issue commenced with um, violence in this community, spiritual violence in this community in Tralee County, Kerry, Ireland, that has not been corrected, that has not been repaired, and that I've been tolerating since I gave birth. Now, the issue of individuals that have been of poor practice, poor procedures, poor professionalism, um, are liabilities in any field of work, study or research. Um, the individuals that have been of obstruction, that have been of defamation, that have been of exacerbation, have jeopardised the integrity of the upstanding agencies and bodies that are duty bound, um, regardless of 2019 COVID measures, to respect the uh, protection rights, the proximity rights and the patronage of um, my child and I. Now, the issue that has been ongoing since 2016 that I've been tolerating as a new mother has not been addressed. The mental illnesses of the culprits that disturbed the peace and that are still to this day disturbing the peace, those culprits of mental illness have been accommodated and facilitated in their endeavours to cause um, harm, damages and loss to my child and I. Um, this matter um, is highly offensive to the field of psychiatry, psychotherapy and psychology. It's also highly offensive to the field of recovery. Now, as I'm of legislation in the field of healthcare, um, I'm really curious about the ethics and morals and conduct and the behavioural code of those that have disrespected my rights. Um, the human rights abuses I'm experiencing are displaying um, the worst, most inhumane conduct, um, the lowest form of behaviour and the lowest form of professionalism ever encountered in Irish society in the field of artificial intelligence, with regard to the field of artificial intelligence and with regard to uh, progress in this country. So to accommodate the culprits of narcissistical, notorious uh, endeavours um, that are highly precarious, it brings me to wonder about the uh, integrity and the decency and the common sense of the individuals that are perpetuating and repeating the cycle of fraud in this country. Now, since 2018, as I've said, I laid new foundations for this country, and those foundations have been disrespected in a very short space of time. I've also been responsible for recovery in many senses. That has also been disrespected. So it brings me to think that people are suffering from a short memory, or they're just displaying a complete lack of gratitude and disrespect without concern for the consequence. Now, as a professional with a very clean track record that has been slandered by culprits in this community of falsehoods and false information, the issue of them having damaged a royal child and sacred mother, a sacred royal, um, brings me to question the irresponsible behaviour in the area of faith, religion and spirituality. As a married woman, my nuptials have been disrespected, my child has been disrespected and my family home